Hey everyone, let's go ahead and start thinking about the new moon on Thursday. So we have a couple more days till Thursday, but I want you to go ahead and start thinking about that new moon energy and what kind of things do you want to start this new moon? Do you want to start a new exercise routine, a new diet, a new job, a new relationship? What kind of new things are you going to create for yourself? Are you want do you want to get into some sort of new habit? Maybe it's some sort of new work habit or a work routine, or maybe you want to change the times that you're going to bed and getting up in the morning so that you can add more to your day or, or whatever, or maybe you just need more sleep. Somebody, I need more sleep. <sighs> so I want you to think about what new projects, new habits new things you want to bring into your life. I want you to write these down and define them very, very clearly. Make sure you're not adding anyone's particular name to anything, do you understand? And you want to write down the things that make the most difference. How do you want your work life to look, to feel? How many hours do you want to work? How hard do you want to work? Do you want it to be effortless? Do you want it to be challenging? Some people are different. Some people love that challenge. They don't want the dull, boring, humdrum, it's too easy kind of thing. They get bored. Then other people, you know, are so stressed out in other areas of their life. They need some of that boredom at work so they can just um, defuse from the rest of their life for a moment. Some people, work is their little me time, their quiet time to themselves because other parts of their life is not so nice maybe a little chaotic so depending on what you want what you're looking for what your goals are define them clearly how do you want your relationships to work how do you want them to feel how do you two want to come together you want to be growing together not growing apart you want to come together and you want to fit like that perfect puzzle pieces right do you want to be arguing and butting heads no so write down the aspects of the relationship, what it looks like, what it feels like. You don't worry about the person as much as, oh, what color hair they have and how tall they are and what their body type is. and None of that matters. Are they a good person? And not only that, do they fit? Do they fit you? Do they compliment you? Do they allow you to be you? As far as your job goes, does it help you grow? Is it meeting your financial needs? Write down exactly what you want out of life. And then we're going to focus on those things every single day. Create yourself a mantra or several mantras, however you need. I have a little something written out that, that I say every day about what I want out of life. How I want my future life to look and feel. What my goal is. How I want to be. How I want to be perceived as well. It's a little bit of everything. And I say that to the universe every single day. Not only am I saying it to the universe. I'm saying it to myself. It's a great daily reminder of what I'm working toward. Who I want to be. Who I am right now. And how I want my life to transform and change. So make sure you write in detail those things and then remind yourself every single day what those things are. Just watch how things start becoming manifest in your life. It's like a lotus flower and as it opens, more and more layers are revealed. Hmm. We've got this. We can do it. Have a great day, everyone. And remember, you have the power to create the life you've always dreamed of. Yes, you do. Get outside, touch the earth, cleanse your space, <gasps> do your meditations. Remember that this Wyatt, the Wolf, the Raven, and Spirit, we're sending you unconditional love. Mwah.